In iron R&D at TaylorMade, we've been chasing fast-faced irons for a number of years. We needed a breakthrough, a real technological breakthrough in order to go to the next level of speed and consistency. The Speed Pocket helps us get to the next level of innovation in iron design. There hasn't been any true innovation in tour irons in several decades outside of perimeter weighting. What we were able to do was focus on one simple thing, and that's proximity to the hole. And we did that through one technology, and that's the Speed Pocket. We actually began working on it about the same time as the Metalwood team was working on it in Fairway Woods and Rescues. However, we found that it took a great deal more time to perfect it in an iron. But as we evolved structures, starting with the Burner 09 and Burner 2.0 and the RBZ, we kept evolving structures to get faster and faster faces. This allows us to get higher COR and more flexibility and compliance in our face. That equals greater ball speed. However, as we kept doing that over the years, we ran into a problem. What happens is we'd make the center of the face hotter and hotter and hotter, yet the perimeter of the iron wasn't getting any faster. We still had a very rigid leading edge, a rigid top line, and a rigid perimeter structure. What this would mean is we would be hot in the center, but we, we would be slower speed-wise, uh, lower on the face. So we knew we needed a breakthrough. We needed a new technology that would allow us to be even faster, but more importantly, be more consistent. In the Rocket Blades model, we actually took 17 and half grams and moved it down in the club head to lower the center of gravity. We took weight from the hosel, we thinned the hosel, we shortened it. We took weight from the top line and moved it down. We took weight by thinning the face more and moving it down, lowering the CG, produces that higher launch angle, that higher peak trajectory that we're looking for. The Speed Pocket is designed for more ball speed. It gives you more distance. But still lets the leading edge flex, which gives us a whole new level of consistency of performance. The Speed Pocket is in the three to seven iron. It's in these irons because that's where you compress the ball the most. So it activates that pocket and produces that higher launch and additional speed the things that most of us can use in a mid and long iron. When we design irons at TaylorMade, we like to think of the iron head as a system of design variables that all come together to deliver the performance we desire. Dustin Johnson, Sergio Garcia, Justin Rose, Sean O'Hare, Justin Leonard, all of these guys have tried the Rocket Blades Tour irons and they were all blown away by the performance. In fact, Sean O'Hare, after he hit him for the first time, he said, I, I gotta play these right away. He asked, he begged us kind of, to put them in play in Vegas. And what was very cool about it is after the tournament, he called us right away, he said, you know what? It delivered on everything you promised. It was predictable, consistent. He felt like he can go at pins that he couldn't go at before. And it was that kind of performance that we think in 2013, that's going to make the Rocket Blades Tour Iron the number one iron on tour. It does so much for us in terms of performance that we believe that moving forward, all irons uh, in this category will have slot features.